Guys, it's here. Let's open this bad boy up. Never. Get her out of the package. This is not sponsored. We should follow Eastwood on Instagram. But you guys are unboxing this with me. This here is a plasma cutter. Grand fucking new. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna read you some of this stuff. The amperage output range, it's only at 40 amps. We also have the output voltage, which is 96 volts. It also has it right here. The duty cycle is 60% at 40 amps, where the um, output for the plug is going to be a 220. Alright, so here's all your cables. You got your 220 plug in right here. You got your ground. I've never seen this before. Here's the magic baby. I'm not going to undo it yet. But there's what the new. Oh, there's some lovely shit. Ow, oh. I know, I'm pretty sure you can uh, recycle that or some shit, but I just threw it in the trash because it won't work at all. So before I begin, I'm going to read the instructions this time, even though I don't want to. This here is the plasma. My phone's about to die, and um, I will upload a video when it is working. Eastwood. Ah! Epic intro, right? All right, so I'm just gonna show you guys an update with the shop, and um, it's like half of a shop and a half of the garage, as you can tell. I'm not going to show my kids on camera because that's just not the kind of person that I like to be and um, not the kind of mom that I am. Anyways, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to leave all my social media sh shit like right here. I'll just put them here in the video. Welcome to this week. I know it's been a while, but at least I've been uploading some shorts because it's a lot more easier for me. But I figured that I would end up uploading a youtube video and um because i have it in probably i don't know three four weeks or something like that but i'm back we're gonna i'm gonna show you guys around real quick um show you a lot of shit that's been happening and it still is happening okay so update on the book if you guys follow me on instagram i um i post daily things about this thing but in case you don't and you just watch me on here. All right, so this here is the newly update on the book. And um, this here is what it looks like right now. I don't really have a name for it. So, yeah. I mean, I did before, but books are boys. So, can't really have a, a girl's name for a boy. Anyways, I changed a lot of shit around. Got a new welding table. It's not new, new, but, I mean, she's a little rusted. Um... But to me, she's new. She got cleaned up, shit like that. video I told you guys that my plasma cutter broke and it was basically just a none cut none none cut video none cut video and um this here is the new baby I haven't tried her yet <sighs> but just uh new tip gun and shit like that you know all that that good stuff move things around here um, I have all my grinder wheels up there, 
all my sea clamps and shit right here on the bottom. I plan on making some more storage on this wall. It's the only wall I got. As you can tell, I moved the back table back here with all of the uh, drills and the table saw as well. I call it a table saw. I know other people call it shit like that. And then, um, the air compressor's right there. I moved it over a little bit. The welder's right there, which I probably should like trade spots with that because it'll be a hell of a lot easier to weld that, but I'm gonna move that right there. That'll be in another video. But anyways, um, let's see. There's the plasma, the new one. And then the welding table. We got the table back here, the scraps of metal back here. And then we got the triangles, shelves, future projects and shit like that. Come down here and you got this whole junk of a desk. And um, I just put all my necessity things that I don't even necessity need. Also moved the vise, made more room for it, scooted everything away. And um, yeah, I had a flag right here, but I ended up putting like catching it on fire one day so i'm not gonna do that anymore and um i told you guys that i was going to end up putting um another wall up right here like another red curtain but that hasn't happened yet so what else has changed is pardon all my kids stuff but this here used to be the paint cabinet down here but i made it mobile and turned like a little what the fuck's this thing called I don't know, a table wheel, a wheel table or whatever. It's like a dolly. I don't know what the fuck it is. But anyways, I converted it into a paint storage unit. And so it's mobile, you can go outside, you can still have things on there. You can hang things from it. That's pretty cool. So, I mean, not bad. This board right here, I'm also gonna make a short for it because it's just a hell of a lot easier. And, um, I'm going to be making my sign right there because in the future, I do plan on having this being an L LC. Um, I do plan on doing... <laughs> my kids are looking at me weird. Anyways, you guys, I do plan on having this being an LLC. I do plan on having this being a welding fabrication area. This here is where it all starts. This here is um, face number one. And them. Um, the signs are going to go up right there. You guys can even see the space. But there's a huge open wall right here. And so that sign is going to go right there. And um, that way it can like look out to the open street this way. And people can see, like, hey, I'm a fucking business. And then I'm also going to get a decal for my truck. That way I'm advertising on that too, even though I hardly ever go anywhere. But, I mean, at least I'm still on social media. So here is the shop. I moved this here over a little bit. And, uh, yeah. So here she is. Get it from this angle as well, so you guys can see. I mean, it's not too bad of a space. It's definitely bigger than the one that I had. And um, the table is mobile, so that's a good thing. But it's like rolling the wrong way. See, just like moves like that. Yeah, you guys, this here is the new shop, renovated. Girls want nails, girls want like eye, sh eye shadow stuff. Whatever that's called, the highlighter, right? Foundation and stuff. Mm -mm. Not this woman. Someone wants tools to build shit because that's just her. I won't even go to the salon and get my hair done, get my nails done. I won't, I don't really like to go to any of that stuff. I mean, like, why wouldn't you can do it from home? But I know that a lot of women out there are going to be like, you need to pamper yourself. I do pamper myself. I just don't like to go to salons. I don't like having anybody touch my hair because I don't feel like... It gets done the right way. I just don't feel rejuvenated, clean. I mean, anyways, you guys, 
this here is the video today is friday and um we're gonna be putting up a fucking video and this bad boy is gonna be moved to this table right here so i can finish it up i'm gonna show you guys just real quick stumbled across this video i have been working on this for at least five months now it is almost done um i have moved the nose and done so much other stuff to it and let me know if you guys think it actually looks like a buck without the antlers <laughs> but uh, it's kind of hard to uh picture it without it so anyways that is the project for next week to finish this bad boy up and uh